guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes 19 and 20 of season one of Dr. Stone. So, um, BTW, as you can see. Yes, I am wearing a bonnet. Yes, I'm not really, um, particularly done getting my hair done. So, um, yeah! Just wanted to say that real quick, because I know a lot of people are going to be like, what the fuck is she wearing and such? Why is she wearing that in this video? So, this is the only time in this video or anything else that comes out today slash this weekend that you will see me in this after next week you will probably not see me in this thank god so this is the only time so um <laughs> it's, <time> for the moment. <laughs> it's not the most attractive thing and such but because of the fact is like parts of my hair up in the front are not clearly done you're not going to see my hair when it's not clearly done so yes <laughs> Other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 19 and 3, 2, 1, go. Now, mind you, I was also supposed to finish this this weekend, or really last week, but I got busy. So, the goal is to finish it this weekend. I'm going to make myself busy as fuck. I ain't got to go to work until the 29th, so bitch. Let's fucking go. Look at him! Who is he? Damn, Jen got fucked up. Oh! Duh. Duh. Oh, I peed. Yeah, I just peed. <laughs> Don't underestimate him. <laughs> I forgot how pretty his voice is. And just like that, we fucking cool. Okay. Okay. I mean, well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, damn, he got everybody. He got a motherfucking archer, too. He is right. My Bambi. Hmm? 
All right. It would just go back the way it was. call him a friend. You just you can call Senku like a fucking acquaintance or something. So you think The fact that him and Sukasa are both on the same, like, agreement and trip, one, it doesn't really surprise me. When you get someone who is on, like, that same wave, like, that you, friend, lover, whatever, ish, you're, you're kind of, like, one in a way. Now, I mean, do I ship it? Hmm. No, I don't. But, it's like, I get the fact is, like, damn, like, I can see how <laughs> influential Sukasa is because I think if, okay, if that shit happened in today's standard, there would always be a person to be like, fuck it, there's no way in hell they would want the rich to do the shit that they're doing now. Remember, no offense, they do get a lot away with a lot of things. We know that as citizens of the United States. I cannot speak for any other countries and such, but, yeah. The more and more I think about everything, it just, it gives you the Hunger Games feels. We just hope one day we don't go to a dystopian future. Please and thank you. I, I do not want to become like that one show that I used to watch. Um, Revolution from NBC. I don't want the power to go out completely and then we're all screwed. Because <laughs> I, I couldn't survive. I could not. No. I'm looking a little disrespectful thing right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Even the way. Oh my god. Who the fuck is it? Damn. 
this bitch. <laughs> but some gymnastic moves. And they just go away like, are you fucking kidding me? Right, you can rebuild the houses, just get out. Hold on, wait, you telling me all these people in this damn pellet? <laughs> They're all fucking relocating there. Oh my god. They have no choice. have to this bitch I really don't fucking like this girl I mean, that is if you can catch her. No, she did smart. Yeah. Homegirl gonna instantly try to kill <laughs> She gonna try to kill him, oh my god. <laughs> uh oh. Literally, I'm a little girl right now from the freaking video. Look at all the chickens! 
What? No. Okay. Test dummy. Ah, still there, huh? It's always something about the goddamn white hair characters because they always the fucking hottest. I can't. <laughs> That's like me rewatching Alice in Borderland and falling in love once again with one of the guys on that show. <laughs> Okay. Right? Oh, uh, okay. Thank God. What? Uh, uh, time out. How? Right? I, I mean, thank you. you. You've been really smart. 19 episodes. Smart as fuck. 
How the fuck can you make a cellular phone? You gotta make, don't you gotta make a freaking cellular tower too? It, it is possible. Are we fine? Like, e even though it's just a fact, are we finally seeing them next week? Yeah, there's no fucking way you can make a smartphone. <laughs> There's so much they have to fucking do. And, and, like, there's only less than six episodes left? Bruh, how the fuck are you gonna do this? He's not gonna kill you, Zuzu. You see, turns you an easy auto, right? No, yeah. Be like, hey, yo, y'all need it. <laughs> okay, I, I think it's just still freaking hilarious that he's going to try to make a phone because th th that's a lot to do a phone. I, I mean. This little freaking thing can do a lot of shit. I mean, but remember, he said it wasn't going to be a smartphone. He, it was just going to be a regular-ass telephone. But, I don't know. I, I'm a little hopeful on it. I mean, you know, he, he surprised the hell out of me out of everything he's made throughout this show. So, who knows? Surprise the fuck out of me again. After this, after this episode and the next episode, I have four more episodes left. And, like I said, the goal is to finish it this weekend. I don't know how the fuck this is going to go down. I mean... <laughs> also, just... Everything was good about this episode. I can't. Like, it was too much. I, I, I'm i literally fucking laughing as how hard as hell because of the fact is, like, three bozos all got killed by some gas. That's sad. Because... You didn't think that they were going to die, but, you know, really, when you think about it, they're dying in the name of science. And, you know, that if they don't have names, sometimes, not all the time, but if they're just, you know, character A, character B, and character C, 9 out of 10, yes, you're definitely going to die for the love of science and such. But the fact is that Homeboy has literally gone back to Shukas and said, oh, yeah, your boyfriend, he ain't dead. Oh, you pissed as hell right now. I know I would be too. You know, you was over here thinking, yes, 
yes, I killed that mofo. I don't have to see that mofo again. And, and then, you know, here comes Gen. And I'm like, oh my god, yes. He's so dead. You did that shit. Yes, sir. Good job, sir. Oh my god, sir. Only to find out that that shit is a lie. I fucking can't. Like, <laughs> oh my god, like, bro. I, I know if his eyes went back now, you know, he'd probably get killed. <laughs> but okay, now here is my here's my biggest issue with them making the phone. How the fuck are they gonna get that to Taiju and Yuzu? Like, without even being seen. More questions that are unanswered. We'll probably find out soon. But go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode 20. Alrighty, episode 20 in 3, 2, 1, go. Don't mind me. I'm eating chocolate. <laughs> Still get to it. Yes. That's a good question. Okay. So that's not necessarily solved. But they'll know.
is chocolate so good. I just don't wonder how the fuck this is going to work. It's definitely going to surprise the hell out of me, though. And, I mean, honestly, you need all the help that you can get. Right? Like, damn. And then that's how they hear it. It's okay. cotton candy machine. <laughs> right? Why a cotton candy machine Makes sense. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. No. Yeah, stink with your stomach and <laughs> hmm? Oh. And so you can make cotton candy. Go on.
but it's good. Right. Yeah, you can right now. Only make it all well. Did y'all just? Maybe kind of just establish trust. Plus, she might be hungry. I mean, did she just have, like, a food gasm or some shit? I mean, just the way she licked it. I mean, did we have to make that hella erotic for a moment? Jesus. <laughs> Right? 
Would that even be... Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm. I don't know about that. <laughs> but now it's going to be used in the name of science. The fact that she immediately was like, yeah, I don't mind, girl.
Seriously? Holy shit. Well, yeah, duh. It's also something used for power. <laughs> right, the fact that he also knew that, like, fucking nuts. That is a good fucking way to end this episode, honestly. So with four more episodes left, which, like I said, we're going to finish this weekend. How the fuck is this first season going to end? I mean, deadass did not think that that was going to really happen. But the fact that it took three whole days, three days, staying up all fucking night, wee hours in the morning, that just remind me of when I first started doing YouTube and I stayed up until, like, well, depending on the show I did, I, I was sometimes staying up until, like, the wee hours of the morning because, you know, at that time I didn't really have a job and such. I can kind of do that now that I'm on vacation, but I choose not to because I like to go to bed at a certain time so I can wake up at a certain time the next day because I need my beater ass just as much as anyone else. But no, I'm so excited! Yay! We got electricity! I'm hopping. You can end the show right here and now, the soccer. <laughs> but it just tells you they're also one step closer to making a fucking phone. Everything his quote unquote dad did, once again, was fucking worth it. Still one of the best episodes, though, in my opinion. But no, fuck yeah! Even sharing the cotton candy with what's his phrase? Uh, I mean. I get it. I, I get the fact that she was very hesitant. I think if anyone was sharing something with a different person, especially if you're on two different sides of good versus evil ish with that, I mean, yeah, anything you're handing the other person, you were like, this is clearly poison. You clearly put something in this. And the fact that he literally had to just, like, kind of... um register her thoughts and being like okay hey it's not poison there's nothing uh, uh wrong with her or whatever with handing the note was a very interesting idea because i mean at first like i was hesitant with her even taking it because of the fact is think about it you're like okay watching some fucking enemies oh they're making this little sand for the cotton candy and being like yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. it's like okay years ago there's just one vine that i loved so freaking much um it was uh, this one guy named King Batch and this other guy, I do not remember his fucking name. And so he asked him to go get him, I think, like some fried rice or some shit. Um, and so he's like, you didn't put anything in this, right? And he's like, no, no, no. And he's like, yeah, go ahead. And he's like, you want me to go ahead and try it? Like, you know, I, I need to make sure it's not poison or anything. And he literally took the fork and like, 
Nah, I didn't put anything in it. See? But he was making the joke of, like, yeah, I kind of secretly put something in there and such. But I, I get the fact, once again, she's very hesitant on that. Because, of course, anybody would. I know I would. But, yeah, did, did you really have to make it kind of erotic in a way? I mean, once again, I'm not a part of that team. But, okay. It made the cotton candy look good. It made me also really want cotton candy, but... I can't go to the store, and that's one, two. I don't feel like going to the store. <laughs> so, nah, I'm, I'm good. But with four episodes left, I really don't know how the fuck this is going to go. One, I do hope that they're able to make the phone in time before Sukasa comes and just, you know, <sighs> terrorizes shit like, you know, of course he is. Like, the man we know he is. But the fact that he also knows about the fact that, you know, he's alive, single, and shit. I get the fact that he's gonna, he's very mindful of being like, okay, we gotta watch Taiju and Yuzuhara because they could do anything at this moment. But something tells me someone's gonna catch their guard down and not watch them and that's when they're possibly going to strike. I'm not sure, but we just gotta wait and see. So... I'll find out this weekend. But other than that, guys, that is my Active Beauty Course episodes 19 and 20 of Dr. Stone. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. and make videos every single day. Enjoy the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episodes 21 and 22. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.